What's happening out there? Boss Mac in the atmosphere. Here we go. Uh, kiss it, baby. And shaking hands, man. I'm out here doing. Look, you hear me? What the fuck I got to do out here? Making it black open. And you are now experiencing the world famous Boss Mac Podcast. RNS, y'all. R and motherfucking S. Oh, yes. Today is a beautiful day. I'm happy as fuck. I be up in there doing this shit. Y'all niggas already know how I get down. Nothing but good game when it comes around. Boss Mac, top soil, y'all got the little motherfucker sound, nigga. Happy to be in this motherfucker. Yeah. Blessings, salutations throughout the motherfucking nation. The Boss Mac Podcast is in full motherfucking motion. West Coast then. Shout out to the chat. Shout out to everybody. The Boss Mac Podcast is brought to you by Boss Mac Streetwear. I got on some real comfortable Boss Mac Streetwear right now. The new bitch relaxes is out right now. Fuck with them. It going up right now. Tab in. Tab in. I hope everybody is doing good out there. I hope everybody is, is in good spirits. Blessings. What's up? Shout out to the chat. Shout out to the motherfucking chat. Yeah. Black Beach. Fat John, Stoner's Committee, Abundance. What's up? Hit the like button on the way up in here. Man, let's get right into it, man. Let's not fuck around, man. It's a beautiful Monday, man. The sun is shining out there. It is springtime. It is springtime in Los Angeles, my nigga. Springtime in Los Angeles. The sun is shining. You never know what's going to happen, man. You know what I'm saying? You never know what's going to happen. You know what I'm saying? You go outside in the morning and you look up in the, in the tree and you see a bird on the branch chirping in the morning. And you just be like, damn, look at that bird. But you don't never know what the fuck is going to happen. You don't know what the fuck is going to happen. Shout out to the chat. Where am I going with this? Diddy raided by the feds. Unbelievable. It's really happening. I can't believe it. Shout out to the chat. The nigga said justice for Big Jake Kim Porter. Hey, man, fight gamer in the building. I don't know who they there for. They might they might be there. I think they there for the, uh, for the sex trafficking. I don't know. Diddy raided by the feds. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Shout out to the chat. Let me know where you tapping in from. Jesus Christ. Diddy raided by the feds. Oh, my God. Everybody's covering it. <laughs> Everybody's covering it. Oh, my God. Let me see if I can cover a little bit of it. <laughs> Let me see. I don't want them to shut me. I don't know if I can stream a stream. Can I stream a stream? Is they going to be tripping on me? Because Diddy is raided by the feds. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What a bad day. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's a bad day. 
That's a bad day. Jesus. Oh, my God. If they outside of your shit like that. Jesus Christ. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. No! Oh, my God. Oh, my God. They're everywhere. They're everywhere. Hit the like button. They raided Diddy. They really did. I can't believe it. What is Diddy doing right now? What is he doing right now? Meeting with the lawyer. Meet with the lawyer right now. Meet with the lawyer now. What's happening? Do they got a warrant for me right now? Oh my God. Diddy. Diddy. Oh my God. Look at that vehicle. Oh my God. Have y'all ever experienced that? Shout out to the chat. Have you ever seen that outside your crib? Have you ever experienced that? The boss Mac Topsoil has experienced that. They was they wasn't looking for me directly. But they was the, it was the homies that did something, so they came to the house. The, you know what I'm saying? Looking for something that the homies had did. But, man, have you ever seen that outside of your house? Have you ever seen that? Oh, my God. Shout out to the chat. Hit the like button on the way up in here. Jesus. Jesus. Oh, God. I don't know if, hey, man, Diddy, if Diddy ain't out the country already, if Diddy ain't out the country already, he can't leave. It's too late now. <laughs> Nigga, you can't, if he ain't left yet, he can't leave. It's hot. Oh, my God, they're everywhere. What's going on? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I can't believe we right here. The ball smack topsoil, man. I keep reflecting on this. I'm going to reflect on this. When I was out in Vegas this past summer um, for Mr. Lucario and them event, I was out there in Vegas. Shout out Miles in the gang, Mr. Lucario, uh, uh, Mr. 1950. You know, niggas was in Vegas, man. And, man, I just remember one of my most profound memories from being in Vegas, man, when I was leaving Vegas. I looked up at Dre's. I was coming out of Aria. I was coming out of Hotel Aria. And, and I looked up at Dre's and I seen that Diddy was performing at Dre's and I was just... I was just thinking to myself, I was like, damn, Diddy is performing. Look, Diddy is the sole survivor. That was last summer. Diddy is the sole survivor. He has, He's performing at Dre's. I could go up there and see him. I, I had that thought. I was like, shit, I could go up there and see him. I could just pull up and just go in there and check it out. I was like, nah, fuck that. I, I'm going home. I gotta get the fuck back to, I gotta get the ba- get the fuck back to the to the house. Fuck that nigga. But I was thinking, I was like, look at Diddy performing. And now it's just, oh my god, look where we at now. Look where we at now. Oh my god, look at him. Shout out to the chat. Hit the like button on the way up in this motherfucker. Craig Mack. That's crazy. Craig Mack first album came out in 1994. Was it today? So many people have died. Fucking with Diddy Black Rob. Craig Mack. I was just listening to Flavor in Your Ear the other day and Get Down. Man, I remember when Flavor In Your Ear came out. 
I remember when it came out. I can't believe 1994 was 30 years ago. I can't believe it. God damn. It seemed like yesterday the boss mic is so old. Oh, my God. The boss mic is old. Hit the like button. The boss mic 1994. The boss mic. Oh, my God. Shout out to the homie Big Jake. Oh, my God. I'm reminiscing right now. The Boss Mac is reminiscing. 1994. Oh, my God. Craig Mack was out. Flavor in your ear. I remember I seen... I remember I seen... What's up? My cat talking to me. I seen, I seen Craig Mack do Flavor in your ear three times. In a row. What you want? My cat is really hard. I seen Craig Mack do flavor in your ear three times, nigga. Shout out Bigger B. Rest in peace, Bigger B. If anybody remember Bigger B in the Unities back in the days. Craig Mack. Nigga. Craig Mack came through with Biggie. They wasn't even fucking with Biggie at first. They wasn't even fucking with Biggie at first. Craig Mack was more lit. Flavor in your ear three times in a row. Crowd surf level lit. Craig Mack just destroyed. Just, I mean, just, it was so many hits on that first Craig Mack album. I remember when Craig Mack came out, Craig Mack first video looked like the future. He looked like he was a future motherfucker. Just like, you in a blab, block kick a flab, got a bit back, quite a bit back, and did the bad hat. Diddy just ate up everybody. Black Rob, whoa. Everybody, shout out to the chat. Gene Deal gonna break dance. Oh my God. Oh my God. Shine, you know what? Shine. You know what? I feel like Shine. I feel like Shine tapped into uh Shine really really bust the gun up in there. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like Shine just really accepted that I, I I I shot my gun up in there, so I'm gonna go ahead and take this time. Niggas threw me under the bus though, but you know, fuck it. I really shot the gun up in there. You know what I mean? That's what I think with Shine. You know, the Miami home. Oh my God! Hit the like button. Shout out to Diddy, man. I don't know what to say, man. I just, you know, let me let me see if we can hear some a little bit of it. Maybe hear some of the audio. Turn it up a little bit. See what they say. May have taken place, or, or alleged to have taken place. So there's a lot of reasons why they might not focus on him per se. Uh, also, uh, there's another thing too, as he runs a fairly large organization. Homeland and, Security. Know, uh, the fact that they don't name him might mean that they're looking at other activities that could have taken place within his immediate you know entourage or his organization uh that involve these properties so uh one can't rule out uh anything at this point because we motherfuckers don't even know why they're there Obviously, this is just their statement <laughs> so what the actual legal documents say and what the statement they gave us is very, very different, let's be clear. So uh, we're sometimes, you know, not privy to all of those details and information until it becomes available at a later date. But uh, you were mentioning the whole search process. We are seeing so many law enforcement officials, investigators, <laughs> and this is basically three properties on this entire, or three homes, I should say, oh. buildings on this entire property in Holmby Hills we're talking about. How long is it going to take for them to go through? through it do oh they have a time God. limit i mean essentially some people are going to come back into the home right at some point so how does that all play out 
I'm, I'm sure if you were to ask them, they'd say it's going to take as long as it takes. <laughs> uh, <laughs> You can imagine uh, looking through one home takes a, a lot of time, but when you have three very large buildings, uh, large buildings with a lot of different oh rooms, uh, various different levels on those homes. Uh, also, they're going to be looking at every nook and cranny. They'll be looking uh, anything, you know, that that's you know subsurface in the home. They'll be looking in uh, basically everywhere they can. They could be using a variety oh, of uh, sensor systems to find out if there's any. Uh, it's fucked up, man. Uh, you know, safes, um, like that, walls that aren't readily apparent. I don't know what to say, man. Hit the hit the like button on the way up in here. Fair use, boss, man. Fair use. I feel you. Fair use. Fair use. Fair use. We just reacting to this. They there super deep, bro. They are there super deep at. Oh my god, the horror. The horror of feeling. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> Shout out Dr. Damien. He hit me with the, <laughs> they raiding Diddy. Oh, they raiding everywhere. Oh my God. They're raiding in Miami and in Los Angeles. Oh my God. They're raiding everywhere simultaneously. Oh, my God. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Jay Hustle, what's up with it? Oh, my God. They're raiding Los Angeles and Miami. Oh, my God. UK is in the building. Oh, my God. Jesus Christ. Oh my God. They're raiding Diddy. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Hit the like button. Suge said in his podcast episodes. Wait a minute. Let me see. Let me get some shit now. God damn. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh. Oh, Diddy. You know what? I feel bad for Diddy, man. Fight Gamer said. Shug said in this podcast episodes a few months ago that Puff that Puffy, I don't want to see you go down, but if you need a celly, I'm gonna grant you my sale boy, and it's happening. Oh wow. Hit the like button. Hey man, I I really damn. Did he? Oh my god. What happened to Diddy? See, uh, niggas need to understand, man. You know what I'm saying? Niggas get the wealth and the power and give in to sexual perversions, man. And your your endless your 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 endless uh your your endless desires for more and more pussy batter bitches, different experiences down the dark path, down the dark path. Down the dark path. Black Beach. What pushes say? Pain is realizing that you poor. As the feds dust busted down your door. <laughs> Woo. Damn. You see, you know. I've seen I've seen the feds come for the homies, man like that you know what i'm saying and um you know um it's just it's just a shocking sad thing you know what i'm saying it's just so shocking you know what i'm saying jesus don't want to see that hey you know I, i don't know man i don't know 
I don't think that guy, I, you know. Do it got something to do with Tupac? What if it got? No, they say it's Homeland Security. It's Homeland Security. It's Homeland Security. Let me see if anybody else got some info on that. Eh. Shout out to the chat. So much going on, man. So much going on, man. Hit the like button. Man. Oh, my God. Homeland Security. So... What what will Homeland Security be there for? That ain't Tupac. I heard uh I heard he gave everybody they publishing back. They said it was a little they said that uh it was a lot of little uh loophole little catches with that. Like you can't once you got that that little publishing, you couldn't s- Say nothing about him no more. You had to shut the fuck up after that. You can't say nothing negative about a nigga. So it's a few of them motherfuckers that didn't accept that shit. I think um, it's a few of them motherfuckers that didn't accept that shit. You know what I'm saying? What a day, man. What a day. What a day in America. Unbelievable. We got the Drake. We got the Drake K Dot Ward popping off. And we got we got Diddy raided by the feds the next day. Oh wow, it's a it's an amazing time in America, man. I thought Diddy was gonna win. I thought Diddy I thought Diddy was gonna make it to be like uh I thought he was gonna get his Barry Gordy on, like, you know what I'm saying? Just live as a, a rich scandalous record executive until he get to a hundred or something. You know what I'm saying? But I didn't factor a nigga would fall off a cliff of sexual deviancy. And you know what I'm saying? You got to be careful, man. You got to be careful out there. I know I be talking this shit like this. A lot of niggas be like, boss, Mac, I don't want to hear that shit. I don't want to hear that shit, man. I'm doing threesomes, foursomes. I'm doing five sums, nigga. I'm getting my dick sucked by two, three bitches. I'm doing all of it, nigga. All. But I'm just saying, though, man. I'm just saying, though, man. You know? Got to have some restraint. Shout out Diddy. Oh man, I don't even know what to say, man. I don't even know if I want to say pray for Diddy. I don't. I don't know, man. It's, I don't know. Pray for Diddy, I guess. Hit the like button. Give me the. Give me the thirty likes, man. Early, man. Look out for the ball smack, man. We in here vibing, man. The good atmosphere is. It's springtime, man. You know, springtime, man. You know. And I and um. Oh yeah. I wanted to say, uh, pull up and fuck with Dubs Organic Coffee Blends, man. Dubs Organic Coffee Blends, 7962 Fountain Avenue, Hollywood, California, man. Pull up to his shop, man, or order this online, man. Plus, they got merch, man. I forgot to shout them out in the beginning, man. I wanted to make sure I got, got my peoples in there, man, you know. Pull up to their shop, though, man. If you come to L.A., man, that's a must-stop, bro. You got to pull up in there and holla at Dub, bro. You got to pull up in there, man, and, and you know, and do you like a full review up in that motherfucker, man. Review the food, bro. Give, it, give him a full review. You understand me? Yeah. Also, the show is brought to you by Boss Mac. Give me a game if you need some game because you're struggling with your bitch out there. Holla at the Boss Mac Topsoil. I got the reasonable race that's great. I promise you, bro. Holla at me. Yeah. All right. Um, shout out to the chat. Uh, I wanted to say that uh, 
How many of y'all really marinated on that future, uh, that future Metro Boomin' album? How many of y'all done marinated on that and just let that soak in and and just try to really let it be a part of your structures? How many of y'all did that? You know what I'm saying? And 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 you know how you feel after letting it marinate a few days? How you feel about it? Oh, shit. What's up with it, Yazzie? Hey, you want some yeah, I see they raiding Diddy. Diddy. Those are his kids they said what? Those are his kids That's Christian and, um, and, uh, just, um, kids is handcuffed? Christian and Justin. Yeah. What? They got Diddy? No. Diddy, or, not, Diddy doesn't seem like he's there. So he just read, they just. So, they, so what they did is they're raiding this home here in Holy Hills. And they're raiding Christian and Justin and Christian and Justin 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 and Sorry for Puffy. Put a two if he got it coming. Put a one if you feel sorry for Puffy. Put a two if he got it coming. <laughs> oh, they got a camp set up. They're going to be out there for about five hours, man. They're going to be out there at least five more hours. Oh, they, he got it coming. Oh, shit. He got it coming. Oh, shit. Look at that grass right there. Look at you see that grass? Look at that grass. Look at that grass. Let me ask y'all a stupid question. I'm going to ask y'all a stupid question. This is going to sound weird. But me personally, since I've never had that type of money ever, do you think Diddy ever been up on the roof? You see the roof right there? You see how the roof is? You think he ever been up there on the roof and just checked it out, like checked out the roof? Cause if that was my house, I would go up there. I would look up. I would be. A, I would go up on the roof and check out the roof. You know what I'm saying? Look at that landscaping. Look at that landscaping. Look at that landscaping. It gives you and it's and it's for it's for the people in the air. You know what I'm saying? So you get a visual of the geometric pattern. Can you see it right there? Look at that. I wonder how did they get some football games on that grass right there. That's a good football field for the little homies right there. That's a that's a nice football. We could get some football popping right there. You know what I'm saying? Nigga. Niggas could get some good football right there, man. The little homies, man. Damn. Hit the like button. Let me know where you tapping in from in the chat. Let me know where you tapping in from. Put a one. If if you don't think Puffy deserved this, put a two if he got it coming. Put a one if you don't think Puffy deserved this. He paid the bitch. He paid. He paid the bitch. He paid Cassie. He paid twos. I ain't seen no ones. <laughs> Straight twos. Niggas don't give a fuck. Okay, I feel you got a one. Got a one in there. Damn. You know what? I thought Diddy was going to weather the storm, man. I, You know, I thought he was going to. Hey, listen. I thought Diddy was going to weather the storm. We got a one. Shout out. Shout out. We got a couple ones in there. I thought Diddy was going to weather the storm. We need our black billionaires to make it, man. We don't have them, man. This is this is a blow to the back black billion. Man. This is a blo- man. White billionaires don't fuck up like this. Did we have is it any white billionaires that fucked up? Damn. I thought Diddy was going to pop back out, man. I was sure that he was going to weather the storm 
And I figured this summer he was going to pop back out and be like, I'm back. I'm good. Everything is good. Living life. Live and learn. You know what I'm saying? You know how he be having campaigns. He come out, live and learn album. He come out with that live and learn album. You know what I'm saying? Had some hard times. You know what I'm saying? But we got by that. Damn, man. Niggas is, oh, my God. Oh, my God. Where is Diddy? I wonder, is Diddy hiding somewhere? Did Diddy know that they was coming today? Did he know they was coming today? Was his money pop? Did he know that they was coming today and was able to get out the way? And if he knew that they was coming today, wouldn't he have got his kids out the way? He would have got his kids. But maybe they not, they not, they don't, maybe they not, nothing gonna happen to them. Hit the like button. Diddy gonna, Diddy trial gonna be big as OJ. Oh my God. But we not, it's not gonna be, but the feds, we're not gonna get to see though. We're not gonna get to see. You know what I'm saying? That's the fucked up part. We're not gonna get to see. We're not gonna get to see. Damn. We're not going to get to see. We're only going to get to see the drawings. You know what I'm saying? We're only going to get to see the drawings. Hit the like button. He might be across the street directing everything. Uh, Maybe. Maybe. Boss Mac Diddy got to leave the country. He can't, he can't leave, nigga. He, nigga, how? How? I guess he could. He could. He could. He could. He probably could. You know? Get into Mexico, some type of shit. You know what I'm saying? If Diddy, man, if, oh my God, Diddy, Diddy a cold motherfucker. What if he on the run right now? What if, what if he on the run and we don't know? <laughs> what if he on the run? What if he on the run and we don't know? Let's see what they saying. What if he on the run and we don't know? Uh, Sandra, this is a Homeland Security Investigations that uh, appears to be on site. Uh, what they're probably looking for is, well, I should say in, in general, uh, they look fair at use human trafficking and uh, sex trafficking being a component of that. And of course, there's been uh, uh, some rather uh, big civil suit stuff that's taken, taken place, but also the New York case uh, where the statute of limitations uh, basically had been rescinded. Uh, oh wanting to look back many years in this case. Uh, part of it was there's a, there have been uh, allegations that, uh, that he was drugging uh, young women uh, so Damn. there was, uh, you know, which, which, you know, certainly implies that it was rape, uh, that had taken oh place my at, some God. Point, at some point. Uh, but I think what HSI is probably looking Diddy at Diddy is destroyed. Is state aspects of it. Diddy is destroyed. That could have taken place. And, uh, Diddy is destroyed. HSI would have a jurisdictional interest. Oh my Homeland God. Homeland Security Investigation is being part of the Department of Homeland Security. Uh, looking at the interstate side, mostly online and whatever took oh place across state lines. And of course, you know, he travels all over the place. So uh, <laughs> oh, oh. potentially transporting women uh, around the country and uh, and whether that was tied to a lot oh, of criminal activity. God. Yeah, definitely Homeland Security involved in any interstate, as you mentioned, and oh. international uh, criminal activity here so what exactly do you think everyone is looking for at this point we saw such a, oh a my large God. number of law enforcement make entry well it, it's a combination of both uh local uh and federal and it's it oh from my God. the local law enforcement has the specific lead at each one of these locations with the federal law invest uh, federal investigators coming in uh, with them in concert. What they're probably looking for is any evidence that they can gather, uh, certainly any images, pictures, uh, video, anything online.
I wonder do they got some motherfuckers that's ready to just they, they got some motherfuckers that you know some motherfuckers that he actually paid he 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 you know what I mean it's like yeah did he pay me you understand me god damn hit the like button we are witnessing the downfall of Diddy, a billionaire. Oh my God. We got to imagine, man. Cassie said he was, she was paying. I, I wonder is this because, I wonder is this, I wonder is Cassie uh, telling? I wonder is Cassie told? Because, I mean, he was directing her to pay. He was directing a bitch to Go gather the strippers, gather, pay for the, pay for the uh, male prostitutes. Male prostitutes is going to tell on you, man. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. There's no, there's no escape. Diddy going to love it in jail. Is he? I don't know. I don't know, man. You know, uh, when you're a sexual deviant and uh, for, you know, the only women, I don't know, man. He got to be like in a protective something because uh, niggas is going to be like, it's your fault. Biggie dead. They just going to round it. They going to round everything together. It's your fault. Biggie dead. You was raping bitches. You was uh, you gay too. Like, everything like they gonna round everything together. It's your fault, Biggie dead really. And you gay. You weird. Um, you rape bitches. You was, you, you know we gonna torture you in here. Hit the like button. Hit the like button. They gonna torture Diddy. But Diddy, I don't know. It depends on how much of the bag he get to keep. You know what I'm saying? I'm, not, I'm quite sure he gonna man. He gonna keep. He gonna have some bag. He gonna have some bag. You know what I'm saying? He ain't gonna get. I don't know. I don't know if it's completely. If it's possible to totally rape him, pure financially. You know what I'm saying? Cause I'm imagining that you know, no matter what, you know, if I mean. I feel like if I'm Diddy, you know, <clears throat> you know, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a have money everywhere. You know what I'm saying? Out the country, you know, and hidden money. You know what I'm saying? Just in case for this, for anything. You know what I'm saying? You know. Damn. And from multiple law enforcement sources that this does involve Sean Combs or P. Diddy. Mm -hmm. But no, this statement, I'll read it one more time, says, Earlier today, Homeland Security Investigations New York executed law enforcement actions as part of an ongoing investigation with assistance from both HSI Los Angeles, oh HSI God. Miami, and our local law enforcement partners. All right, Dang. provide further information as it becomes available. Of course, we're oh trying to get them to God. send us on Did camera, it. but they said, uh, the lady in particular who sent me the statement says she's not allowed to. Thank you so much. Yeah, not really clarifying a whole lot, though, but clearly understandable because uh, right now, maybe they're not in position to divulge any more information. So let's Remember all them nice popping bottles, man. Remember all the times. Thank you so much for your expertise in all this. I don't Remember all the bottles, all the bottles, the bottles that got popped through the years. Shout out to Nori and the Drink Champs. All the bottles that got popped through the years. Just to, you know what I'm saying? Look at that sculpture right there. Look at that. Look at that sculpture. Look at that. It's gold. I wonder, is there, like, solid gold on that? I wonder if he put gold on that, or is that brass? The house in Miami and L.A. Miami and L.A. Oh, my God. 
was Mar-a-Lago like, rated like this? Well, you know, it wasn't. It wasn't as. It wasn't. <clears throat> You know when they raided Donald, it was a it was a respectful. You know it was respectful raid, nigga. It wasn't like this. A, this is shitty aggressive raid right here. This is shitty. This is like yeah, nigga, yeah, nigga. We we always knew that you wasn't supposed to have none of this shit, motherfucking rotten ass motherfucker. Yo, fault Biggie dead. Yo, fault Tupac dead. All, all, all kind of shit, nigga. I'm so happy this is happening to you, nigga. They probably playing some Tupac. I'm, oh, wow. I bet you they probably playing. They probably, man, listen. I bet you they probably walking around. <laughs> I bet you. I bet you. I bet you they walking around playing Tupac. Somebody, somebody playing Tupac on their phone. Somebody playing Tupac on their phone right there, nigga. I'm telling you, man. I know they is, bro. Right by Diddy's son. They playing Tupac. I don't know, man. They ain't saying nothing about Diddy. It seemed like he got to be on the run. <laughs> it seemed like he got <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Like, it seemed like. Them being there with them type of vehicles right there, like you see them kind of vehicles, it seemed like that if Diddy was around, he would be in with they would he would have on handcuffs. There would be no way he could kick it with them while they did that. They, you know, nigga, you in handcuffs, nigga, right here, nigga. I wonder where you at. I wonder where you at, man. Where's Diddy? Large buildings with a lot of different. Where's Diddy? Various different levels on those. Also, they're gonna be looking at every nook and cranny. They'll be looking anything. Oh shit, man! Surface in the home. They'll be looking in basically everywhere they can. I remember using a variety of sensor systems to find out if there's any. I remember some years ago, a nigga I know was like. Hey, this nigga Diddy is in um, Newport Beach. My people say, pull up. We could go pull up and fuck with Diddy. And I was like, what? He was like, yeah, we could go out to Irvine and, 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 and fuck with Diddy. I was like, man, I can't fuck with no nigga that had my homie killed, bro. I can't be nowhere near dude, bro. I can't be around, old boy. Because if I get around, old boy, and um, if his security can't get me, I'm going I'm to do something for real on GP. I don't give a fuck about no wolf, none of that shit. I can't fuck with that. Hit the like button. Where's Diddy? That's a double A. You know I was going to tweet that. Hashtag. <laughs> You know what? I'm finna tweet that. I'm finna tweet that. Hashtag where's Diddy? Let's follow Russell. Record label and clothes. He was with Russell overseas. See them niggas, man, engaging in the sexual deviancy. You know what I'm saying? I know it, man. These niggas, man. The sexual deviancy, man. Why even why even be in the music industry if we can't do the sexual deviancy? Man, if they find little seeds somewhere in there. Man, he don't fuck with little seeds. Little seeds barely living. It's lit out here. But you cool if you mind your business. Yeah, you know what? And I'm gonna tell you something, man. It ain't like I'm terrified of Stockton or nothing like that. I like all that, man. I like. I, I always felt like, you know, when I'm driving up to five and I'm going, you know, and I'm going to, uh, you know, to the Bay Area, and then you know, you start going into the Bay Area. I forgot that freeway. I think that's the 80 right there. I forgot what it was. That freeway. But anyway, man, uh, 
you know, I just feel that energy is stocked, and man, I start feeling real nigga energy right there, man. As soon as you turn right there, Fresno kind of, but you know, you start feeling that real nigga energy right there, and you just, you know, and then you drive into the real nigga atmosphere. You know what I'm saying? I love the Yay area, man. You know what I'm saying? Part of my, part of my development. Damn, bro, they get, oh man, did he? Hit the like button for Diddy. Damn, man, Diddy. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. All right. Let me, um, let me see if we got some more, um, oh, my God. They just so, they just so deep out there. They just. That's the L.A. Uh, that's the L.A. Uh, property. You know what I'm me? That's the L.A. property. Damn. They just, oh, my God. Look how deep they are. Oh, my God. Damn. Oh, they coming out getting stuff out the box. Oh, my God. Oh no, that they bringing stuff out. Damn. Oh shit. Oh my god, the whole world watching. The world has shrunk and the, the world the, the world has shrunk down for Diddy. You know what I'm saying? Diddy can't go get Diddy Diddy can't pull up. Diddy can't pull up at the burger stand and get a burger and french fries right now. You know what I'm saying? If he pull up to the burger stand and try to be like, let me get a burger special. Let me get a burger special. You know what I'm saying? Uh, with a with a Coke. And and the, and the person behind the counter going to be like, whoa! <laughs> They're at your house right now! Oh, shit! Man, I don't know if I can serve you, man. Damn. Oh, shit, I'm scared to serve you. <laughs> oh, shit. I wonder if the police would swarm on him right there. If he tried to, if, I wonder, I wonder is it is it cool for him to be somewhere or do they got a warrant? I wonder do they got a warrant for him, right? <laughs> oh, did he go? Joe Blast, I feel your pain. They acted like Diddy a terrorist. I feel your pain, Joe Blast. You say they're going above and beyond, taking down the, taking down one of our billionaires. I know what you're saying, right? I feel you. I feel you. I feel you. But I'm telling you why they I'm telling you why they coming at him like this right here. You understand me? I'm trying to tell you. I know, I know niggas hear what I'm saying and be like, Ball Smack be, be uh, Ball Smack over there imagining making up his own narrative, fantastic story ass nigga. Listen, nigga, I'm telling y'all, this is Kamala Harris right here, bro. And this is, this is, this is Tupac. This is based off of, that the root of this is Tupac with with but this is the but this is the uh what do they call it the uh the um pretext this is the pretext to fuck him over right here the pretext is you know what I'm saying? You human trafficking and shit and you pimping really and you you know what I'm saying? You 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 buying you you know you sex trafficking. But really it's because you had something to do with Tupac. And um you know what I'm saying? We pulling it all together on your ass. We dumping it all together. Keefy D ain't play a part. Hey, bro, like, listen. Yeah, Keefy D play a part. You understand me? K- 
TVD provided the narrative that led back to Diddy. I'm trying to tell y'all, man, this is, I'm telling you, man, this is, this is Kamala Harris saying, get, go get this nigga. Fuck that. He has something to do with <laughs> He pimping. Hey, I want y'all to, hey, we got him. Go get that nigga. Fuck that. <laughs> And then once he in there for this, once he in there for this, then once the Keefy D shit get going, they're going to have him come over there for that too. They're going to, they, I, I think they're going to have him for that too. I'm freestyling, but I, I just feel like, hey man, I'm telling you, man, get the likes up. I'm telling you, man, I'm telling y'all niggas, this is, a. Uh, hey, they playing, I bet you. I'm telling you, man, I bet you niggas is playing some Tupac over by their son, bro. I would, nigga, just play, I, listen, just be playing some, <laughs> play, keep your head up. Niggas play, keep your head up. Niggas play, keep your head up. <laughs> They're like, hey, man. I'll let y'all listen to some music while y'all sitting here, man. And it's got to be Tupac. Or only Tupac. We can only play Tupac. <laughs> Get the oh, shit. You know they playing Tupac, bro. You know they down there doing it, man. You know they doing it, man. They got to. You got to. You got to play Tupac. Now, Drink Champs is cool. See, you know, um, Revolt got that nigga out the way early, right after the uh, right after the Cassie shit went up. Um, Revolt got him out the way because they, you know, they seen complications coming. You know what I'm saying? So Revolt went on and got him out the way. So now, you know. Um, you know they got act, they could get at him now. You know what I'm saying? Revolt, revolt got out the way, so you know Nori and them would be safe. You know what I'm saying? But I ain't that ain't saying that niggas won't have some fallout now. It might, it might be, it might. You know what I'm saying? They might, they might review all the Nori, uh, Diddy, all the times Diddy was on uh, Drink Champs. They might review all that. You know what I'm saying? That that. Uh, that that one podcast he did with Fabulous man, you know, that's a all that's a, that's a uh, you know what I'm saying. That's when he was pressing Fabulous. We seen we seen the gangster press, the gay press. We seen a gay press. You know what I'm saying? On on Drink Champ, nigga, nigga did a gay press on Drink Drink Champs, and niggas just let him do that. Like niggas just let him live with that. It was, it was boo that 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 he did that. <laughs> it was boo that he did that. Fabulous should have got up and slapped the shit out of him, man, and just said, "Y'all niggas got to pack me out. Your security got to pack me out, nigga. You can't talk to me like that, nigga." He should have got up and slapped the shit out of Diddy and just said, "Y'all nigga, your security got to pack me out on Drink Champs, nigga. You can't, nigga. Nigga, I don't give a fuck who you, nigga." Nigga, you in here talking with your security, nigga. Hit the like button. Hit the like button. Diddy. Damn. Damn. Where is Diddy? Where is Diddy? Let's see. Let's see if they spotted Diddy yet. Oh, man. Where is Diddy? Federal of the law of the United States of America is 18 years old. Wait, wait. We don't give a fuck what the state says, bro. I'm telling you right now. Wait, bro. wait, put me on gate. Wait, why is R. Kelly locked up? Like, you know, like, like, hit, hit the like up. button. Illinois was 17, right? Boom. They couldn't hit him with that. Remember, the state of Illinois dropped it because the girl was 17, right? Okay. Now, R. Fair use. Not any impression. 
the girl was 18 years old. He didn't know she was 17, mm, right? Okay. He didn't find out until later on, and that's when he cut her loose. But when she was 17, he has, uh, he's crossing state lines and shit. You know what I'm saying? Oh. Now, that's where the motherfucking traffic and shit comes into it. So let's say you taking a sprinter, fuck it, we going into, you know, Ohio or some shit or whatever the fuck, we taking a sprinter. You take your chick, she's 17, you cross that state line, bro, and you got the traffic in. But federally, federally, they charge them in the feds because the age of consent is 18 years old any state up on the United States of America. Yo, but, but, whack, I'm gonna be honest with you, I think Diddy too Yo, powerful. state is 16, act. Yo, yo, but, but, but Diddy too powerful to get caught up in that, that like, di- yo, powerful hold on, people, hold on, be honest, be honest. The United States of America, the government, the no, no, you're right, you, hold on, you're no right. no nigga that but, powerful, bro. But, but, when, when they got, when they got Kelly, Kelly didn't have the power that Diddy got. Diddy is What the... power does he, all he has is money. Bill got money, nigga, Bill still went. What he better do is what R. Kelly did and hire Bill Cosby's attorney. That's why R. coming back on the appeal. He got Bill Cosby's attorney, right? Same situation right now, bro, is that this shit's like 34, 35 years old, right? Now, I know, I do know this. They are not raiding those places looking for any type of proof that has anything to do with this case in 1990, 1991. They are raiding those places based off some shit that Cassie, a woman that was with that dude 15, 16 years, then told him, these niggas be having these saves and secret walls and these niggas like to keep shit. You know what I'm saying? Oh, you think... I got video banging my... Hit the lock button! From the back, I got him. I turned him on, bro. Uh, So you think... We all got videos, act. You got videos What's your chick act? So, so you think Diddy got the freak off? No, hey, and, why no. you just try to duck that act? What? Are you gonna cop to it? No, 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 no. Of course, I was got. Listen. Okay, there you go, there you yeah. go. Now, now what you think? Hold on. Act? But, but, but Diddy wouldn't record no damn freak off. Come on now, not, not, come on. Crazy, bro. No, he wouldn't. Cassie said, Stop it. Watch this, bro. Let me tell y'all, Cassie got the money act. Follow me. Talk you are me. a very intelligent man. Follow me. This is how Cassie got the money. Cassie came out and said. Yes, I would order the male prostitutes, the strippers. They would come. We would have sex, and Diddy would be naked filming us. You recall that? Yeah. Did he say filming or just watching? Filming. Did you recall that? Now, look, right there is where the extortion started. I'm going to tell you why, Act. She stopped it there. You know what Diddy knew she could, could continue to say? And then after... I was done with the male prostitute. Diddy would go over there with him. <laughs> oh. Why? 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 This is a fact. You already know that was coming. Hit the like button. Watch this. Let's say I did a bank ro- a robbery, right? And, and me, you, and the homie that be your editor was involved, right? Yeah. And I come up and I say, yeah, it's some robberies went on. And let's say I'm in jail, right? It's some robberies went on that I can speak on, you know? We drove a certain color, a blue car, you know. Motherfuckers was driving. They know who they are. They need to holler at me. Act, hey, you know you was the driver. And I'll stop right there. You go to contact somebody and say, what that nigga want, man? No, no, no. No, you're right. You're right. Oh, no, no. Diddy was running over there. Yo, no. Yo, what? Hear what I'm saying, though. Diddy been in hot water for the last. Yo, he been in hot water for the last six months. If he, if you don't think he deleted everything, he done spent. He didn't. I'm gonna tell you why. No way. For the very reason why you just said what you said. Diddy is powerful. He let the money go to his head, bro. He don't listen to nobody around him, bro. He think he bigger than the program. He think he's slick. He probably Cassie been gone five years, bro. Whatever she knew about. Whatever safe, whatever, whatever, all oh, that shit should have been over with. Not to say she ain't gave him some shit. Don't think she left her body there, nigga, without some shit. 
And feds are not finna kick in the door on three motherfucking matches at the same time if they don't have some shit. In different, I, I in different states. In different states. In different states. I told you they was coming. I, bro, the minute they admitted it, and she said she was 16 years old, and they gave me liquor in the state of New York and ran a train on me, I knew they was coming. <laughs> Fathers, never be a homeboy to your children. Mothers, never be a homeboy to your daughters. Okay? Listen, you seen them boys in cuffs? Listen, remember the other accusation. They laced the liquor. The producer said Diddy's sons assist him and lacing liquor and giving it to everybody. They know that piece will at best or worst force Diddy into standing on it. But what they don't know, and 50 know this, Diddy don't give a fuck. They gonna have to stand by themselves. Wait, 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 wait. what do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? Only two people we may fall for, and that's them little girls. Them boys, oh, he gonna make them ride it out, bro. The nigga, this nigga, Lil Rob, whatever this nigga name is, said, and it's other people that have said, Diddy and his kids are in cahoots with lacing the liquor. I whack well, honey. Man, now we know it's a transgender activity. This week, we oh, know. Shit. Shout out to the Tronics Network. Y'all tune in and subscribe. We launched today. It's been some transgender activity. We know this. Act, I'll send you the content. Right? Whack. I'm gonna be honest with you. Whack. I'm gonna be honest with you. I can't hey. pick that up. Hey, whack. Fuck. Hey. Fuck with the What's up? Yo, whack. I know you always trying to bet some money, and I might be down to bet some money. I don't think Act, there is are you no. You telling me? You telling me? No way, no me? how did he gonna end up in a goddamn? He ain't ended up in cups. Okay, watch this. No way, no how. Look, he's on the jet already headed to where he headed. They know where he's going, right? I, I, he I, I heard they met him he there, too. He don't bail out. Listen, he might not bail out because it's bad. Why nah. the fuck is Keith D's son calling me right now? Is this, what the fuck? Keith D's son. Uh, listen, <laughs> Shout out. Diddy is not okay. going to jail. Or did he go to jail? Diddy is oh, bigger than the program, I'm telling you. Hit the like button. Bigger than the federal no, he's That's bigger. Bad. He's bigger than no, no. I'm not saying the government. He's bigger than the program. If he was bigger than the program, why did little old Cassie take him down? Shit. And I got a bone to pick with you, act. Stop fucking for young Miami. You trolling her, bro. It ain't no truth in that shit you talking about. What? You trolling her. Wait, we gotta get her aside. We gotta no, get her aside though. Aside. Wait. Hold on, ain't no side. Look, her and Diddy was business partners. They was associates. No. Nothing exclusive she said he him. peed in her mouth. Nah, you Hold can't on, do that. Listen, bro. You can't do that. Bro, listen, she said he listen, peed in her listen. mouth. They weren't business partners? Yeah, they were business partners, and oh, okay, he peed in her mouth. You're telling me they wasn't a... Look, Diddy had a baby. Hold on, on. Yo, yo, hold on. Whack, whack. Whack, whack. whack. Hold on, whack. You trying to make him exclusive, Whack, bro. whack. This is our catchy right here. Because... This is how shit go wrong. When your business part, because put like this, Diddy and Cassie were business partners, but then no, they were a couple. Did you read the they lawsuit? Wait, no, 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 no. I whack. I'm being you now. Did you read the lawsuit? She said, she said the C. Day. She called him a business partner that would use his influence to get engaged with her sexually and to coerce her. We all watch Diddy. Take that female from that other artist. She lived with that dude 14, 15 years, right? They were a couple. We all know that. That's Cap. So wait, if so it wait. wasn't a couple, it wouldn't have said Cassie cheats on Diddy with trainer if oh. it wasn't a couple. Okay, so 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 whack. You trying to tell me that <laughs> you trying young to tell Miami, me Hold uh, on, you trying to tell me young Miami didn't say that Diddy be peeing in her in her mouth? This is what I'm saying. No, 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 hold on. Right. Are you trying to say that? I'm talking to WAC 100. We have, this we have the saying. content. I'm saying that Young <laughs> Miami was not exclusive and privy 
to that shit. Hold on. Whack, whack. I didn't say she was. Whack. I didn't say she was. Whack, whack. I didn't say she was. But if you think about the allegations in, in, in the in the civil lawsuit and why the feds coming in, you think the feds ain't gonna question somebody who was saying that Hey, he was peeing in my There's mouth. Nothing to question, young Miami, about. Yes. He never made any accusations. What? 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 You Even don't. With what you're saying. They got to question her in real. case it wasn't consensual because she's only came out and said what he did. Fair she you. Never said the I requested it. Bro, check this out, motherfucker. Are you asking permission to freak your woman when you freaking your woman? Okay, babe. Up next, I want to. Whack! This. You just Up said next, he, she wasn't his hair. woman. Okay, babe. Can I do this next? Whack! Oh, you God. just told me she wasn't his woman and that he had a baby on her. So who knows if she was in cahoots? Well, hold on. This is what I do know. Right? She got some respect for herself. She grown. I don't she know. She does she what she wants to do. Hold on. She does what she wants to do. And let me top it off with this. That's what Let's that's what Diddy like, thought about Cassie. Hey, bro. Hey, young Miami ain't no bum bitch, bro. She got a support system around her, bro. It's the same she with Cassie. No, it's the same with no, Cassie. No, it's no. The, no she was out there in the water by herself. She had to be there. Young Miami has a support. She's successful. QC is there. Her family is still there. Her baby daddy is still there. Two total different situations. No, 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 whack. You You're not told. reading the situation right. You told yeah. because, come on. No, no, no. JT, JT is about music. Young Miami is about escorting. Let's be honest. JT That's is promoting a Hold tour. On, bro. That's a false accusation. Young Miami has never been arrested or never been accused of doing no escort shit. If she wishes and choose to go out and accompany somebody. Yeah, I think they still QC. Bro, that's her yeah. fucking right. Yo, right. They just she ain't really putting out music right. like Let that. Let me ask you a question. She said, she said, me and Diddy, we go together real bad. The next week we saw Diddy have a baby with another woman. What would you call I it? feel you. He be having some of the I'm info, though. That's an associate. You call her a side chick. She was a side chick. She was a side chick. exclusive, bro. So she was a side chick. She has a right to date and not be fucking exclusive to anybody. If men could do it, you know what's crazy? When men do it, you like, oh, I'm just, you know, I'm doing me. So when a woman wants to do it, all of a sudden, it's a double standard. Get the fuck out of here, Why? bro. You if know she was in the free car. That she's dating, he's dating. Then a woman could also date somebody. And not be tied down, bro. Whack. Have her fun, bro. Whack, you know she was in the freak off, man. Come on. Yo, whack. Whack, whack. Don't nobody know. This is what we do know. She is a city girl. Whack, right? whack. Let me ask you a question. You know. Let me ask you a question. Hold on, bro. Those police you see girl. surrounding the property, they didn't only surround it in L.A. and New York. They surrounded it on Star Island. There's bad so videos. Okay, that ain't the first or the last, right? Bro, how do you know... That young Miami just wasn't stroking his ego. Why? Come on, why? Come How you know, bro? She's a beautiful woman. Hit the bro. like button. Hit the like. Give me the 70 yeah, likes, why? though. This is where I'm going to get mad at you for, though. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to get mad at why you. You, you know, I love you. Me, I'm going to tell you why. As long as you don't no, hear it, No, no. no I'm going to tell you why I'm going to get mad at you. I'm going to tell you why I'm going to get mad at you. So, so you telling me you okay with young Miami turning her back on Diddy at the moment she need him? You know what? You know what did he need right now? He need a personal testimony from somebody who been with him to say, "Hey, I've been with that nigga." One thing for sure, two things for certain. He don't do nothing against somebody. Will I could test? I could testify to it. Anything me and him ever did was consensual. Everything I ever see him do was hey, on the what up you and mean up. Anything y'all ever did? What you did with Diddy? Nigga, see you what trying to switch it up. <laughs> No, I'm talking about now. No, young Miami. I'm not gonna spin. Why she not doing it? Why she not doing it? Why she not doing it? Hold on, let me answer it, bro. Go ahead. You said she's turning her back on Diddy, right? She did. He bought her a house and a Maybach. Let me tell you what I do know, and these are brownie points and a salute to Diddy. Let me tell you what I do know. I do know that Diddy had enough respect. But that young lady and her career to tell her 
this is not for you, and I want you to go your way, right? You see, she went to BET. You didn't see Diddy stop trying to stop that. Diddy, with his own free will, right, looked out for that sister and said, look, I got shit going on that has nothing to do with you. It's best that you disassociate. So she didn't turn her back. Diddy just looked out for that young sister, bro, and did what was right. Yo, whack. I ain't gonna lie. This is why I always tell people: if y'all in trouble, if your friend is not whack one hundred, you in deep shit. What do you whack. mean, friend? Bro? Whack. You know I'm damn well. Miami, Stop it. You know five. damn well. You know damn well. Young Miami basically was talking all that shit. Told my she with him. Yo, she was she was dissing other women. Hold on, hold on. She was dissing other women. Hold on. Yo, whack. Whack, whack! You wanna bet? You wanna, you wanna bet two thousand dollars just for fun? I guarantee one of them people that the feds done talked to is that girl Gina. There's a girl Gina that was used on and off. She was beefing Young Miami at that point. Young Miami tweeted at her and said, "Bitch, you know I could have Diddy have you on all fours eating my pussy." That's what. That's what. Uh, uh, um. There's nothing wrong with that. Is she illegal? No, well, it would be illegal if Diddy is forcing her. If Diddy is no, forcing no, that woman not, to do it. You know what it is, Act? What? You ain't live the good life, Act. Oh, you not oh force man. It, act. <laughs> no. If a female was willing to participate, right, in fellatio with another woman, and they're both of legal age to consent. She said, I'm going to make man, Diddy make you. Hold man, on. Stop it. Whack. You spin him. She said, I'm going to make Diddy make you do that, not give you a choice. I'm going to tell Diddy to make you do it. No. Hit the like, like button if you like, just came up in here. Let me know where you tapping in from. They asked you, do you want to be arrested? Do you want a robber to break it? It's role play. Wait, what door? The green door? She's not going to be involved. With nothing illegal that has nothing to do with sexual acts, because she doesn't have to. Anything she desires, she can get that the right way. Whack. Act. I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm so surprised by you. I can't believe your co-signing Young Miami turned the back on Diddy. Diddy's about it. What's up? What you talking about, bro? D D D Diddy is going through the hardest time of his life, and a girl he bought. And a I salute Diddy. I salute Diddy for saying this young lady. This young, beautiful, talented lady should not be, should not be, have to deal with this shit. No. And to tell her, I love you, it's been nice, That's fake. but as a man, as a man, I have to tell you to disassociate yourself from me, because I got things going on in my life that have nothing to do with you. Whack, you whack, if whack. If young Miami respected him, you can't put that on. Hit the whack. like button, y'all. Because she was How the do one. How you think show got over the BET? Yo, she Did was the he fight it? Hold on, she was the one running around this bitch told my act bad, act bad, act bad, act bad. Santa Clarita in the building, salute. She left. She left. She left. Yo, you know what they showed on the news? Bad, Did, no, no, no. Yo, whack. We was live streaming it. You know what they showed on the news? They put what Justin that? Combs and King Combs in cuffs. Salute to his son. Okay. Listen. But they also said they also said, Lil Rob said, that allegedly the kids a, a kids help Diddy do shit, bro. He but allegedly that, bro. also said that Young Miami's cousin took his dick out and sucked it. So basically he implicated Young Miami too. I know you love Young Miami, but put it like this. They need to go search her crib too. She might have like a pink dildo and a Diddy butt plug in there. We don't know. <laughs> My phone died. <laughs> hit the like button. Hit the like button. Ball smack tapping oh, in, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Hey, whack! I didn't hang up on you. Uh, I wanted to get. I wanted to get some trying. good. I wanted to get some whack 100 commentary. You know what I'm saying? You know whack 100 come through with the proper commentary for you, man. You know, you know a little bit more extra. You know what I'm talking about? Hit the like button on the way up in this motherfucker, though, man. Hit the like button on the way up in here, man. We doing our thing. How long we been going? We been going a couple hours. A couple of two hours and shit, you know what I'm saying? We vibing, man. Um, uh, a very, a very, uh, 
A very shocking day. A very shocking day. Witnessing the downfall of Diddy. Witnessing the downfall of Diddy. Hit the like button if you have not hit the like button. Show some love. We are witnessing the downfall of Diddy. Let me see if there's anything extra. Diddy, where is Diddy? Diddy on the move. Diddy on the move. Let me see. Let me see. I think they're still running the same. Oh, that's it. I guess they done covering it. They done. I think they done. All right. Um, Shit, man. What can be said, man? An amazing situation. Amazing day, man. Um, I am going to have to... Let me check some shit. I might have to come back. Let me see. Uh, come on, man. Give me the 70 likes, man. Show some love to a nigga, man. Give me the 70 likes. Damn, what the fuck? How'd you do that? <laughs>